So the next thing that happened on Friday Night SmackDown, before I get to the main event, we got to talk about a few things. Now, we've seen uh, Sonya Deville and Charlotte Flair brawling backstage, going at it. Uh, Charlotte th beats down Sonya. The referee comes up, pulling her off of her, and then a bunch of security guards and stuff like that, just pulling them apart. Uh, Charlotte stops. Sonya Deville kept on attacking her, and then Charlotte grabs her and throws her over this, uh, you know, this crate, and then... Um, she feels like, all right, I'm done and all that stuff. I'm trying to stop, because, but she won't stop at all. And then all of a sudden, Sonya Deville jumps up behind her, attacking her again. They're just going at it. So, yeah, that's what happened there. Um, but, yep. And then after that, we see another part with uh, Cody Rhodes' uh, you know, part, like his stories or whatever about the injury and stuff. So, yeah, that's what's been going on as well. But then we get to the main event. It was Kevin Owens versus Sami Zayn 1-1, -on -one, and it was a pretty good match going back and forth and everything. At the ending of this match, we've seen uh, both of them on the top turnbuckle. Kevin Owens hits that fisherman suplex off the top turnbuckle to Sami Zayn. Both of them gets on their knees, just going at it, laying in some rights and stuff like that. Just keep on going at it, brawling and stuff. Uh, Sami Zayn... Uh, you know, ducks underneath the clothesline, grabs him with a half notes and suplex, hits it onto Kevin. Kevin literally immediately jumps back up to his feet, and then he gets hit with a second one again. Sami Zayn goes to the corner, about to hit the Hallover kick onto him, up until we seen the Usos come up attacking Kevin Owens, causing a disqualification. So yeah, Kevin Owens defeated Sami Zayn by disqualification. And so as Koa was in there, all three of them just beating down Kevin Owens. They hit the 1D onto Owens as well, laying him out. They throw him outside of the ring. Uh, Sami Zayn's just shocked about it, you know. And then Owens was trying to fight back and everything, throwing Jey Uso into the barricade and stuff. But then Solo Sokoa hits a Samoa spike onto him, hitting him with a super kick again. And then hits a second Samoa spike onto him again, laying him on the announce table. And then it was like, Sami, you did good and all that stuff. And then after that, we see Solo on the barricade. He runs and jumps off the barricade, hitting the Uso splash onto Kevin Owens through the announce table. So, yeah, that's what happened there, and Owens got laid out. So, yeah, uh, for that match, I'll give it three stars. That's why I'll give it. I hate when matches ends in DQs, but I, I'm i okay with it, you know, with this one or whatever. So, yeah, uh, match of the night, though, the Intercontinental Championship match. Gunther versus Braun Strowman, that was a pretty good match. But yeah, uh, next week on SmackDown, the guy contract signing with Roman Reigns and Kevin Owens and many more stuff. So yeah, um, like, subscribe, subscribe to Team W Wrestling on YouTube, subscribe to my other YouTube channel, Word of Chris, and subscribe to this channel, Chris Wadales, and follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and both of my TikToks. I'll be down there in the description box. For tonight's Friday Night SmackDown, I'll give it seven and a half stars as well give it was an okay episode of smackdown so yeah um i'll see you guys later for this monday's monday night raw reviews see you guys later until then